Hey guys, so today I'm going to show you how to make colored powder. It's also called holy powder because that's an Indian thing. But anyway, my parents are making some quiche in the background, so if there's weird noises, just deal with it. We are going to need cornstarch, lovely, food dye. We're going to be making blue today, wonderful, water. And a stand mixer, or you can do this with your hands, with attachment that's like this, or something like it. And uh, our stand mixer is right there. Beautiful. And then we're going to put our stand mixer on and turn it on very low. Oh, very low. Maybe I've been turning it off a couple times. Because what happens to uh, cornstarch and water, as you may know, maybe not, it turns into this thing called oobleck, which is a kind of thing that when you stir it really fast, it behaves like a solid, and when you stir it really slow, it behaves like a liquid. So I decided to get my hands dirty and uh, mix it up because it was a lot easier than using the spoon. But um, but here, let me just show you some cool stuff about this uh, non-Newtonian fluid. It's called, which basically means that it doesn't behave like a normal fluid. All right, so I can gr quickly grab it up, and then it just liquefies and falls out of my hands. So. And here's a. Trying to get a good angle. And the other thing is I can let my hand slowly go into the bottom. And I can slowly pull it back out. But if I stick my hand in and then try to qu quickly pull it out, look what happens. Yeah. Another cool thing is, you know, uh, certain things you can peel away from like the wall of a bowl, like, like dough, you can easily pull it away. And so if I do it quickly enough, I, I can do it with this, and yeah. So I can pull it away from the wall, and then liquefies. And then squeeze it again, it's a solid, liquid. Solid, liquid. So uh, my hands are stained blue, if you can't see. So that's uh, fun stuff. Okay guys, well I'm officially a smurf, that's not any of this stuff. Right there, that's that's just my hand. Um, yeah, so I've transformed. Anyway, so now we we're setting out to make powder, but we have all this stuff now. So what do we do with it to get it to powder? Well, we wait. But because we're going to let uh, the the water evaporate out. But in order to uh, make the evaporation go by faster, we're going to pour it out into a pan. And... Yeah, look at that. That's crazy, dude. I know. Close enough. And I'm just going to, uh... Doesn't look cool. I'm just gonna spread it around so that it um, can dry out faster. That just looks wicked. Okay, well I'm gonna go and take this and stick it on top of a register so that you know heat maybe will make it cool down faster. So I decided to make an orange batch, and uh, here's um, here's another cool thing about it that I forgot to say with the blue stuff. You can. Uh, so, and this is, has, has to do the same thing with you moving your hands fast in it, and it is hard, and then slowly you can go through. But anyway, yeah, so look what happens when I punch it. Actually, I'm going to go around to the other side. I got some oobleck on the camera. Okay.
cool stuff. My fellow Americans. So anyway, the powder isn't going to dry anytime tonight, so for the purposes of this video, I'm not going to show you what it looks like. But basically it takes a day and a half to dry, and once it's dried, you take it and you stick it, you scoop up all the powder, which will be, in, you scoop up all the uh, stuff that's dry, and it'll come out in kind of like chunky, powdery, kind of like flour that's a little bit wet, and uh, and you take that and you can stick it in, inside of a um, blend, some kind of blender, coffee grinders work, a um, bunch of different things work. Uh, and then what I do, you, you can, after that, you can just stick it in a container and just pick it up and throw it and it looks cool. Or what I do is I um, grab some old stockings and cut them up into sections and then you can stick and then tie one end off and then stick it in there and then you can throw it and that way you can pick it up and throw it again and it looks cool. So I have some video of that and that's what I'm going to show you right now. Play.